Hey, beer people. What's up, y'all? Brewski Brothers here today, not tonight, for Good once, day. with DJ. Hey. Outside. Outside. Beautiful day. Finally enjoying a nice day. Um, tell, tell us what, what, you, what you got for us today, man. Let's let you do it. Speak a little. Bit. Okay, well, I decided I would like to homebrew beer. So we got my brother-in-law, who had done it before, and he came by with a Blue Moon clone. So we decided to brew some up, because I drink a lot of Blue Moon, and when I come over, I usually bring some. Uh, so I decided we'd start with that and learn how to do that, and that's what we did. Yeah, man. Blue Moon's like one of your favorite beers, right? Pretty it much. is, yeah. This I is like a nice beer. white wheat, that, and some Poe Garden. There you go. So we're set up a blind ta taste test. It's a challenge. Well, not a challenge. It's not but a challenge, but just to kind of <clears throat> see what, 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 what the, they, they we've taste got comparable. This and this. So we'll see uh, how what close they are, or, and which one we think is the Blue Moon, and which one we think is the uh, DJ Blue. The DJ so, Blue, yeah. yeah. I like that. I like the name of that, DJ yeah. Blue. That's smooth, yeah. man. That's smooth. So, I, I'll get two. Yeah, go take your centers. All right. So. All right, well, here you go. Um, I'm gonna, I want to smell each. Yeah, let's enough. go ahead and give them a sniff. <coughs> mm. Oh. I think I can tell by I can the smell. Tell, I can tell by the smell. I can, too. I can tell by the smell. I think it is... Oh well, no! I, I, I'll say it. I'll, I'll say yeah, it after I, I taste. Me too. I, I have a feeling. I, I, I think I can already smell. I can smell that that craft. Yeah, man. I can smell the home. Beer. I can smell. Your house and me, I could tell just before that because I drink it a lot. Right. Um, and of course, yeah. we'll say afterwards why. Yeah. Beforehand. I can tell you. I can tell. Yeah, you I can tell. I can. I'm, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. All right, let's go. All right, ahead. let's go left. left. You're on the left. Cheers. Oh wait, yeah, yeah. 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 That's good for this weather, though. Mm -hmm. That is good. That is nice. Beautiful outside. That is beautiful. All right. Now I'm going to try the next one. That's it, man. That's it. Right. The right one is That is DJ's. That is a clone. Yeah. I can taste it. I can, I can smell, smell it. I can smell it. I can smell it off the rip. You can smell the actual ingredients. Right? I can smell more orange in it, too. I think the only cheat with this one is, of course, with clear glasses, where you can see this one's just a little darker. Right, exactly. And that, that kind of led me... Well, even just the smell, too. Like, but it smells. You can smell... I don't know. You can smell, you can smell beer. And what I thought was great is in every bottle, there's no sediment. Now, in most homebrews, they say there's supposed to be yeah, sediment. Yeah, should be. I was right. worried about that. And and it all cleared it out, bar, but it's really you know it's clear just for wow, sitting. Wow, man, that is good. Well, that, is, go. that is like I, that is like Blue Moon on Royce. Yeah, I was gonna say, I like it better than Blue Moon. I like so. it because you can taste the hops. Mm -hmm. I will, I will, I'll taste one. I will taste one. I said, hey, it waves. It doesn't taste like nothing. <laughs> so you can taste the coriander and the orange. Right? Yeah, and and, and we I don't actually think used you need that orange. Yeah, yeah, I had the orange and a, a whole what? It was twelve ounces of honey that we put in there. Yeah. Because yeah. we actually were there in the brewing process, the brew. and you're, you're obviously going to see all of this stuff that we speak of. Right? Yeah, or have seen it. Who cares? <laughs> we play it out, man. But uh, it's it's an, yeah, enjoyable beer. It's great. I weather. really enjoy it. Yes, I really do. It uh, makes me not want to drink Blue Moon ever again. Yeah, you know because I, I just want to drink that instead. The DJ Blue. Yeah, we, DJ I think Blue. you just watched the birth. DJ Blue. You just watched the birth. Yes. Good job. It was. I'm gonna bring you guys a uh, dark IPA. Um, it's built off of, I guess, what they called the Pirates Plunder Recipes. It looks okay. like it would have been back in the day. But I've added a, I've yeah. upped the ABV and added a little coffee flavor to the back. Because I figured if you're a pirate on a ship, you got to make beer out of what you can. Mm -hmm. And one I of mean, the things I think they would have had most often around beer. that time is coffee. So I thought uh, I'd boost it so that they wouldn't be so dry with the extra alcohol that I've added. Nice. And then I'm going to bring you a pumpkin pie ale. That's exciting. Yes. A high That's ABV. Just in time for Thanksgiving. Thanksgiving, yeah. Um, and I love, I love pumpkin beer. Yeah. More of a dessert beer. Not that it's going to be sweet, but if the uh, alcohol would be cream high, on that you shit. don't have to drink a lot of full stuff. Yeah. We can try that. That would be good. Whipped cream, <laughs> whip, whip cream on that shit. <laughs> but there you go. Well, apparently people are moving. Yeah, we so just it's time moved for us a truckload of beer out. <laughs> yeah, that was a truckload of beer that we just sent out. But there you go, man. We appreciate you bringing it yes, by. Yes, no that's 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 great. It was awesome. We look forward to the rest of the beer. you got plenty. Yeah, we've got plenty of things. You know, the, the blue moon might be untouched, but we'll see what happens. <laughs> so, maybe you learned something, maybe you won't. <laughs>